Hello everybody, VHUTuda here. Uh, this should have been my first tutorial, but it's not, and um, I'm doing it now. This is um, uh, setting up hammer. Wow, should have done that a long time ago, huh? So when you first uh, open up hammer, it's going to ask you if you want to set up some configurations. It's going to ask you if you want help. You don't have to get the help. But um, when you'll get up a game configurations tab like this, except it'll be empty. So hit edit, add. Um, Now you know, you're just gonna put your own uh, name for it, and then hit close. Put the drop-down list. Click on that, and game data files. Uh, usually, um, these game data files come with Hammer. So uh, browse to your Hammer folder, and then go to FGD, Half-Life, and uh, Half-Life. That's set. Now the wide texture format and map type, leave it as is. And the default point entity class should be um, info player start. And you can choose between funk door or funk wall, or you can choose any of them. But uh, I like to use funk door. Now, for um, if you're using Steam or the WAN Half Life, uh, usually this would, for WAN, it would be C. Sierra Half-Life and then you hit OK but if you're using Steam it's my computer local C program files program files times 86 if you're using Vista and you go down to Steam Steam apps account name double click Half-Life now it's gonna ask you for your mod directory if you're using one it would be Sierra Half-Life Valve but it's not in this case right now. So program files, Steam, oops, Steam, Steam apps, account name, Half Life, Valve, okay, Valve, and then uh, it'll be the same thing for the next line. So you can just copy and paste that. RMF directory, which is where you keep all your map files. Um, save it anywhere. I have a folder called Hammer Maps, so I'm going to put that there. Now for build programs, take the drop down list and uh, do that again. Uh, game executable. For one, very easy. C, Sierra, Half-Life, HL.exe. But right now it's Steam. So, program files, st uh, Steam, Steam Apps, Counter Strike, or er, uh, Account Name, Half Life, HL.exe. Now, CSG Executable. This is your compiling tools. Now, the default compiling tools are a piece of crap. So, I suggest you download ZHLT 3.4. Uh, um,. I already downloaded ZHLT, so I'm going to go to the folder, and if it's CSG, choose HLCSG, BISP, VIS, and RAD, etc. Now, this is where uh, all the compiled maps will go. So, uh, if it would be uh, WAN, Sierra, Half-Life, Valve, Maps, but we're not. We're doing Steam. So, C... Uh, program files, Steam, Steam Apps, account name, Half-Life, Valve, Maps. There. Then, you're almost done. But you need textures. So, uh, your list won't be filled like this. But, um, let's say it was, uh, say it was, you go to Add Wad, and uh, you can get them easily from the Half-Life 1, Sierra, Half-Life, Valve. You want to take um, Liquids, Half-Life, 
decals, and Zeno. And if you don't have uh, the Sierra Half-Life, you can get them from your Half-Life GCF folder, which would be um, Program Files, C, or Program Files, Steam, Steam Apps, and your Steam Apps folder. You'll have all these things. What you should do is get GCF Scape, and once you've downloaded that, you open up the Half-Life one. Wait for it. Well, Steam has to be shut off, but uh, you'll get to see everything that's in that file right there, and you should extract everything in there, and I have it extracted to Half-Life GCF, and then it'll be in the Val folder. So Half-Life Lewicoids decals and Zeno. And then once all your wads are in there uh file decals half life Zeno liquids. And I need my two custom wads for which um HLF two and K which is for my mod. Then um apply O Apply OK, don't worry about that error, you won't get it. And then, um, file new and choose your game. You'll have all the textures from Half Life, these are extra ones. Um, you'll have everything in the entity list, and Hamill will be set up. Have a good time in Hammer. VHE Tutor.